Hi, my name is Erky. My name is Jemima McGrimmer. My name is Jessica Hartman. My name is Abelia and I'm a young artist and finalist in the Northern Beaches Environmental Art and Design Competition. My work, Dark Sky, is about air pollution. I watch news about diseases caused by air pollution for example asthma and lung diseases in my picture you can see lots of smoke coming out of the chimney that makes the sky dark if everyone could save energy and use recycled stuff we will have less air pollution my work is a textile piece mainly comprised of crochet and knitting pieces, but weaving as well. It's about the climate crisis and coral reef bleaching and the rising temperature in our oceans. I'm really inspired by the intersection between art and activism and using art as a tool to communicate important messages. My artwork, Lepotiris plasticus, is made of beach plastic I found on the beach. It's trying to convey the message that it's sad these days that's more likely that you're going to find a piece of rubbish than something beautiful in nature. The message I'm trying to convey is that we should stop using single-use plastics as it is swallowing up our beaches and soon our earth. I think as children we can contribute to environment conservation and preservation. My work is coronavirus under the lens. I love science and art. So I created this artwork to demonstrate the effects of environment on human health with the collaboration of arts and science. In this artwork, I have depicted a roughly spherical flower acting as a viral envelope of SARS-CoV-2. In addition, I used the blue leaf skeletons as the background to paint the sadness and isolation in the pandemic. As Dale Carnegie once wrote, when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. This quote is nevertheless true today. This pandemic has granted us a second chance to appreciate the environment. Therefore, we should all work together, respect our environment and create a better world.